We're ready to start sewing the waistband, and I have pinned this an inch and a quarter down, and I've pressed it, and it's nice and even. Now, after you get my approval, you'll be ready to sew. And when you are, you're going to sew right along this inner edge. It has to be right along there, because if you do it too high up, your elastic's not gonna fit in, plus your quarter of an inch is gonna flip out. Now, what you could do to make this easier is take this off, and just like you would do on the uh, ironing board, you kind of just slide it in there. You don't want to sew this back part, so kind of just slide it in there. Another thing you want to remember to do is to switch it back to stitch length two and a half because we don't want to use a basting stitch anymore. And we are going to back stitch. So we're going to start here. A few stitches, go back, and you're just going to sew right along the edge. Take the pins out if you need to. Nice and even all the way around. And we're going to do, it's basically a circle, and we're going to stop about right here. So we have that opening to put our elastic in. So I'm going to go ahead and sew all the way around. Sew over your seams. should be rather easy because basically you're just sewing, sewing a straight stitch. It's getting stuck under that other arm. Almost through. Okay, we're getting close to the back to the start. Don't forget to leave a little opening. So I'm going to go ahead and back stitch right there. We're going to sew that shut uh, later on. So as you can see, I sewed right along the edge and left the opening, and don't forget to back stitch.